Hey guys, Kevin the Gamer here. So last night, EA dropped a SBC for an 80 rated Tim Cahill. Now, it is a very cheap SBC, but apart from that, this actually means quite a fair bit to us Australians out there. For those of you who don't know, I'm also Australian, like Tim Cahill. And for us Australian FIFA players, this means quite a fair bit. Even Tim Cahill retweeted and posted on his Instagram about you know EA releasing this so it also means a fair bit to him as well so I thought why not do a play review on this really nice SBC Tim Cahill so this is the team I have put him in I have tried to include you know as many uh, no, like half decent Australian players we don't have the best national team um, so I have tried to include you know just some nice Australian players so in goal we have Matthew Ryan his Movember card you know I thought Go something a little bit different, a little bit you know nicer looking than his uh, normal non-rare gold card. Um, but then left back we have Bernat. Centre backs are Laporte and Um Titi. Right back is Rizdon. Uh, right centre mid is Troisi. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce it. Uh, CDM we have Angelo Gomez. Um, so, uh, left centre mid, sorry, we have Renato Sanchez. Left wing we have the Aussie. Just the sweatiest Aussie in the world, Matthew Leckie, 91 pace in the Blunders League as well. So it's really, this is a really nice way that you can link uh, this into, you know, other leagues. Then right mid, we also have a Blunders League um, Australian, and that is Cruz. And then centre forward, we have Tim Cahill. Now I'm only playing him centre forward because of his pace. Now I'm not a pace whore. But I do like to, my strikers to have at least 80 pace. Um, but I do recommend you pl guys play him in either a 4-3-2-1. That way it's really easily just to put Matthew Leckie in and Cruz in. And then you can just link up the team. Make a whole like really nice Bundesliga team um, with Tim Cahill striker getting full chem. Or play him in a 4-3-3-3. So then he will be playing at striker. And you'll score some insane headers with him. Um... So yeah, let's get into his stats. Okay, so I've just quickly gone into a single player match just to show you guys his in-game stats. As you guys can see, he has 95 aggression. You know, he has half decent acceleration. You know, it's not the best as I said before. He's got really good balance, 99 jumping. Holy crap, that's insane. He's got really good reactions as well. And his strength, you know, is pretty good. Okay, guys, so this is his other set of stats. He has uh, really high shot power, actually, and that heading accuracy. 99 heading accuracy. Holy shit. This just proves, guys, that he's, you know, he's only 5'10", but holy crap. If you, if you, you know, you're running down the sideline with Matthew Leckie, you cross the ball in, Tim Cale gets his big head on it, you'll fucking score. Like, not like legit 99 times out of 100, you will score a header with Timmy Cahill. You know, he's also got the power header attribute, and he's also very injury prone, which, it, which you know, in FIFA is very good. So, here we go. This is the first game, by the way, that I've played with this new Timmy Cahill. Um, so, yeah, let's get right into it. Okay, so he's come down the wing. He's going to, um, I thought he was going to cross it in. He cuts back in, and then Matthew Ryan just comes up with a very, very nice save. Okay, here you go. I've taken a corner. Now, for some reason, I had Tim Cahill auto assigned to take the corners, so he could not get headers in off these corners, right? But we do end up actually getting a pen here, which is very, very nice. Early into the game, we've got ourselves, you know, a chance of getting a very nice goal. Definitely a foul. Here we go, Tim Cahill on the ball. We've gone to the left, and we've scored. Oh, Timmy Cahill. Under 10 minutes, and well, he's already scored. Holy debut, crap. Martin. This is going to be good. Well. Without turning a hair, he made it look easy. Yeah, I mean, this boy is a composed penalty taker, and he showed it there. Really, really cool strike that. Okay, so we've taken the ball here, um, played a nice, very, very nice season. three ball to Tim Cahill. This he's cut back inside, he's taken the shot, his keeper saves it, but we are lucky enough to get the rebound. And that puts us 2-0 up. Now what I will say, guys, is Timmy Cahill, 
he can find the back of the net pretty easily. He's got very, very nice shooting, and he's also got very nice dribbling. Um, as you see here, boom, that was a re really, really powerful shot. We're just lucky to get the rebound on that occasion. But if you do take shots with Tim Cahill, most of the time the keeper will actually hit it, and then you'll get a chance of getting a rebound goal. Here we go, we're coming down the field now. We play a nice three ball, Tim Cahill, and he has scored. Legit, like the 43rd minute, and we've scored three goals already. Holy crap, two of them are Tim Cahill as well. Now, yeah, Tim Cahill, boys, he's got very nice dribbling. Also, we come down here just before halftime, we've crossed it in, and Tim Cahill has got an another goal. Three goals in the first half. Now, I also got something I want to talk about. I did not take a single header in this whole game. And that's, you know, pretty much because I do not like taking headers. I do not like crossing. That's not how I play. In my normal team, I have, you know, a 4 1 2 1 2. Here we go. We have actually gotten another penalty. Holy crap. Just after halftime. Um. Yeah, another pen, but I don't like crossing in. I'm not one of those guys that runs down the wing and crosses in like over and over again. But if you are one of those guys, um, Timmy Cahill just goes really well on striker. As you can see here, guys, we actually did score another penalty, um, and that was pretty much it for the rest of the game. He come back and scored a late goal. Um, that's pretty much it, guys. So overall, Matt Ryan is insane as a keeper. I'm not even joking. He's really good. Um, Tim Cahill is a really nice striker, as you can see he got man of the match and a 10.0 rating, 4 goals, um, I don't know what to say about him, he's just so good, um, his passing's good, his dribbling's pretty good, um, and even, he's got, you know, 57 defending for a striker, which is also unreal, um, yeah, so, overall, I recommend getting Tim Cahill, you'll see the big YouTubers say they're not going to use him, because they don't think he's that good, um, I think this has proven wrong. He's insane. The only problem is he does play in the high on A League, so it's really hard to get links out of that. Um, but yeah, if you use Matthew Lecky and Cruz, you should be able to go full Bundesliga, maybe switch it up a bit like I did and make a three league hybrid. Anyways, guys, I hope you all enjoyed. Go out and try this SBC Tim Cahill. He is insane. <laughs>